Hello everyone, it's Neo Geo Repair Time again. So, I've already done a video, which nobody's seen, on this one, where I thought this would be a really easy fix, and it actually turned out to be a bit of a nightmare. So, this video and this Neo Geo is on hold, and instead, we're going to look at this Neo Geo. So, I got these both in the same batch, and it was a really good deal, but yeah, they were both broken, and I thought I could probably fix both of them. So that one is maybe not fixable, but this one I think is. And at first I thought, oh, this will be the, the difficult one. So basically, well, I'll put a video up on the screen. Um, this is it running, and you get these lines down every sprite. And I was wondering, oh, maybe it's some graphics chip problem or something basically unrepairable. But... When I actually looked at uh, how the Neo Geo arranges its sprites, it looked like it could be something as simple as a bad connection between the cartridge slot and one of the graphics chips. And so, instead of just piling straight in and checking the hundreds of lines that connect to these things, I thought uh, I would have a go at modifying MAME and seeing if I could get it to output the exact same problem as I have on um, on my console. So I'll put up another video here as well and yeah you can see that yeah this is the problem because I've managed to replicate it in in the emulator and the problem I tracked it down to the CROM line and it's line number 11. I had a quick look at the cartridge slot and that looked fine and so then I looked at the pinout on Neo Geo Dev Wiki and found that it was that pin was the one. So I started tracking it, I tracked it from there down to here, and then I tracked it from here to this board, and this is broken. So I can prove that. So I try C13, that works. C11, no connection. C9, that works and C7 that works so yeah it's just that missing connection so I think the fix will be just to solder a short jumper wire between those two points and it should work again So there we go, that's it all reassembled. Uh, it has this bodge wire which comes around from uh, the back there. And so I'm going to try this out now and we'll see if it works. So here we are, moment of truth time. Let's see. Uh, looking pretty good. And there we go, that looks perfect to me.